We already took a look at Vary Audio in Level 2, so make sure you check out those videos if you're new to it. We're going to finish up our look at this cool feature by talking about all of the things that we missed when we took a look at it last time. Let's start by talking about MIDI input. This allows us to change the pitch of a note on the fly using a MIDI keyboard. You can switch the MIDI input mode by Alt clicking on it. This mode is called Still Mode. I'll explain this in a second. Make sure Pitch and Warp Mode is selected and then activate MIDI input. Select a note and hit keys on your MIDI keyboard. See the note moving? In Still Mode, as we've already experienced, we can only change the note that's selected. We can, of course, select multiple notes to change them all at once if we want to. Let's try the other mode now. Alt or Option click on the MIDI input button. Notice that the picture on the button changed to look like steps? This is Step Input Mode. Step Input Mode is awesome because you can start it off by clicking on a note and then hitting a key on your MIDI keyboard. Cubase will automatically select the next note in the sequence, so we can just hit a key on our MIDI keyboard again. This allows us to quickly change a melody or a phrase, or even create quick harmonies. And when you're done, just deactivate the MIDI button.